Wow, here we are again today, for in him we live and move and have our being as certain also of your own poets have said, for we are also his offspring. Acts 17, 28. Let's not forget that. We are the offspring of God in this day, in this age, for today. Are you acting upon that? Do other people know that? Finally, brethren, he said, farewell. Be perfect. Be of good comfort. Be of one mind. Live in peace. And the God of love and peace shall be with you. 2 Corinthians 13, 11. Listen to this Old Testament one in Ezekiel 36, 27. And I will put my spirit within you and cause you to walk in my statutes and ye shall keep my judgments and do them. Wow, what a scripture. And we can just think, he gives us that. That is a gift from God to you and I, that we may be able to walk in those. Romans 8, 31 through 39 is another great uh, scripture. Listen to this. What shall we say then? Uh, to these things. If God be for us, who can be against us? You know who your biggest enemy is, your own self. And uh, he that spared not his own son, but delivered him for us all. Why did he deliver him? For us all. That's why he did. How shall we not with him also freely give us all things? Who shall lay anything to the charge of God's elect? It is God that justifieth. Who is he that condemneth? It is Christ that died, or rather that is risen again, who is even at the right hand of God, who also maketh intercession for us. That scripture right there, that one verse right there, has the total, 100%, the whole gospel in it. Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall tribulation, or distress, or persecution, or famine, or nakedness, or peril, or sword? As it is written, for thy sake we are killed all day long. We are accounted as sheep for the slaughter. Who is killing us all day long? We need to kill the flesh all day long, ourselves for God. Nay, in all these things we are more than conquerors through him that loved us. For I am persuaded neither death nor life nor angels nor principalities nor power nor presence uh, nor things to come uh, nor height nor depth nor any other uh, creature shall be able to separate us from the love which is in Jesus Christ our Lord. Romans 8, 31 through 39. Wow, it's been good to be with you today. I pray that you'll have a good day today and we will see you uh, next time. Right. Bye-bye.